Hello, this is Reverend Ken Wilcox at the Center for Spiritual Living here in beautiful St. Augustine, Florida. And today I'm talking about love, how to give love and how to receive love. You know, when I was a young person, I was desperate for love. And I really didn't have very much success in finding love because I didn't love myself. And in fact, I didn't even like myself very much. I had the really misguided idea that I could find someone to love me so much that it would convince me to love myself. But that's not the way it works. We have to love ourselves first. This is the first act of love. You see, it, when we don't love ourselves, we are doing the most harm to ourselves. We are the closest of God's creation uh, to ourselves. And so by not loving ourselves, how can we love God? And by not loving God, we shut off the channel and the conduit for universal love to come to us. So the first act of love is to love yourself. And why shouldn't you love yourself? You're doing the best you can do. Sure, you've made mistakes, but you're only human after all. Even the saints tread on the grass. You can't be here in life and not make mistakes. So forgive yourself. Spirit most certainly has. And love yourself. And when you love yourself and are willing to share that love to those around you, you are going to find yourself overflowing in love, shaken down in full measure and overflowing. It's what happened in my life and it can happen in yours. This is your truth. It's the truth in my life. It's the truth in yours. And so it is. Satisfy my soul. Let the new day begin.